Have you ever wondered why there are so many geese in Boston crossing the road? Or why the Charlie card is called the Charlie card? Or how many steps it takes to climb up the Porter Square train station? Well, that one is only 95 steps less than the Bunker Hill Monument. Welcome to Bostonology, a daily newsletter in the index for all things Boston. It was founded by my friend Peter and I, um, my friend Peter and I. So, each newsletter has a word, a photo, a piece of trivia, and a link to something interesting. So, for instance, in this Mass Ave uh, newsletter we had, we linked to some awesome archive photos of Harry Houdini strapped in before jumping into the Charles River and attempting an underwater uh, escape. So, we wanted... <laughs> We wanted to do a newsletter because we wanted to mimic the experience of receiving a letter or postcard in the mail. We wanted each email to be like an ephemeral experience. So we send our email every Monday to Friday at 3 o'clock. And we chose 3 o'clock because we really wanted our readers to have a little Bostonology break from their workday. Our first post was on May 5th. And it was titled City Upon a Hill, and we sent it out to 10 of our friends. Since then, we've had over 100 posts with words ranging from hello to cheese and over 600 readers, including my mom and her friends. <laughs> I just want to tell you a little bit about my favorite stories, my favorite newsletters. Scratch tickets. So this just looks like a bunch of tickets on the ground, but it turns out that scratch tickets were actually introduced in Boston. And Massachusetts spends more on lottery tickets than any other state in the country. So we linked to an article that the Boston Globe had posted about lottery consumption in Massachusetts. It's a really cool post. I recommend checking it out. And then Mary Sue, who was a very interesting find, she was one of the biggest, she was one of the very big community activists in the Chinatown community. And she helped transform the neighborhood that was known as the Combat Zone. We also linked to a documentary that showed a bunch of people in Mary Suhu Park playing Chinese chess, which is one of the most popular games in the world. And then, sometimes, events really catalyze our emails. Uh, I really want to showcase this fun event in Somerville that happened this past weekend called the F What the Fluff Festival. And it was all about fluff, which actually was invented in Somerville. So there are little stories like this everywhere you go. Boston has a lot to offer, and we've had our readers actually start sending in uh, photos that they, of their very photos of Boston, and um, we've actually started curated posts where people can send, can create their own emails. So we really want more people to participate. I know everyone in this crowd has an interesting story, so come join the experience. Thank you.